Listening Part 1. Now listen to the passage and choose the correct answer. The most common traffic problem in cities around the world is traffic jams. Sao Paulo in Brazil has the world's worst daily traffic jams. According to reports, the historical congestion record was set on June 1st, 2012, with 295 kilometers of vehicle queues around the city during the evening hours. Some other big cities also suffer from serious congestions in the rush hours. The main cause of this traffic problem is the increase of the population in big cities. So the number of people using the roads has risen several times. The second reason is that the roads are narrow and, and sometimes are not good enough. Also, many road users have no respect for traffic rules. As a result, the problem is getting worse and worse. Listen again. The most common traffic problem in cities around the world is traffic jams. Sao Paulo in Brazil has the world's worst daily traffic jams. According to reports, the historical congestion record was set on June 1, 2012, with 295 kilometers of vehicle queues around the city during the evening rush, hour, evening rush hours. Some other big cities also suffer from serious congestions in the rush hours. The main cause of this traffic problem is the increase of the population in big cities. So the number of people using the roads has risen several times. The second reason is that the roads are narrow and sometimes are not good enough. Also, many road users have no respect for traffic rules. As a result, the problem is getting worse and worse. Listening Part 2 Mr. Lamb is discussing with his students how to save energy at home. Listen and circle the phrases you hear. As you know, we use energy for cooking, heating and lighting. But it's not cheap. So how can we save energy at home? Lin, what do you do to save electricity? Well, I always turn off the lights before going to bed. I have some electrical appliances, such as a TV, a CD player. I turn them off when I don't use them. I think it helps us save electricity. Right. What about you, Min? Well, we use low-energy light bulbs at my house. We always turn them off when leaving the room. We use solar panels to warm water, too. It's cheap and clean. Sounds interesting. And how about you? Listen again. N. Mr. Lamb is discussing with his students about how to save energy at home. Listen and circle the phrases you hear. As you know, we use energy for cooking, heating and lighting. But it's not cheap. So, how can we save energy at home? Lin, what do you do to save electricity? Well, I always turn off the lights before going to bed. I have some electrical appliances, such as a TV, a CD player. I am off when I don't use them. I think it helps us save electricity. You're right. What about you, Min? Well, we use low-energy light bulbs at my house. We always turn them off when leaving the room. We use solar panels to warm water too. It's cheap and clean. Sounds interesting. And how about you?